Hello guys, how is everyone doing? Man no camera. Anyway guys, why I actually pick up the um camera is because I just got back from work now. Short day today. And um no, don't ask me why am I looking so corporate? I don't have a corporate job. <laughs> um it's just very basic. Very very, very basic stuff and it's monday so i wanted to brighten up my day anyway that's not why i'm starting this vlog i mean knowing Jaden, you think Jaden is kind of a troublesome you know looking for trouble in school it's been like three times i've gotten this um letter like literally a handwritten school but knowing Jaden, i must think that is a naughty boy in school but he's been getting a very good reward he's gotten head teacher reward this is the third time Jaden has gotten a teacher reward and it's for this one is for being kind to everyone <laughs> it was so funny when i said i was like Jaden, kind to everyone but oh my god this is so bright oh gosh gosh but it's so nice when i receive things like that at home why is this thing so bright i will can you see camera if i hey. Okay, finally. Anyway, when I get things like that, I kind of sweet my body small because I'm like, oh my god, my Jaden. I mean, with Jordan, I'm like, Jordan is always doing good. But Jaden, I mean, that report card, I'll find the other one. I'll see. There's two. I don't know what the other one was for, but I've not been paying attention exactly to what he's doing really good at. But this one just striked me when they said being good in school. Anyways, I'm back. I'm home now. I'm not gonna be vlogging because I just I have some few things I need to do. But that was I was opening letter. I said, let me let me tell you people that Regidin is a good boy, even though he can eat the whole house finish. <laughs> He's a good boy in school. Do you guys think this is a sign that I should get this? Because I've watched this thing go down. Now it's now 12 pounds. And it's <laughs> I'm here to do a return and I've said that I've reduced that thing. I feel like this is the chance. I just need to get it. I just need to get it. Should I wait till it will be six pounds? <laughs> oh my god, you guys can I even see me. Please tell me why is here who is here. Is this my goat or um good head of goods? Why is there is here yet? Wow. I fear decoration now. I need to go now. This is my mom when she was little in primary school. <laughs> you guys... He looks like a boy. He looks like a boy. He looks like me. Can you guys see that? Mom, you, are, you look like me. Like... Let me see, let me see the picture. I'm trying to show the guys <laughs> again. <laughs> oh, this thing should focus now. But why was I even squeezing my face? Jesus, <laughs> yes. Lord. I look at flower girl. Which flower girl? That's the flower girl. I'm sure it's, for it me, still looks like a boy. I don't know why they like why you and the flower girl look like boys. <laughs> <laughs> it's a boy or girl. It's a girl. It's not George. She didn't say it's George. Oh god, it was my brother that sent this to me. I was like, who is this? But when I now saw the face. Is that actually me? Is that it? was primary school. So I went this to one, this one, one this primary school. Are you sure school. this is actually you? It's me or oh. I know because ah. I'm always doing inter-house sports. That's oh, inter-house sports. Uncle Sultan said, Uncle Sultan. Yeah, it was Sultan that sent it to me. <laughs> and I was in Blue House. And that was Odun Soya House. <laughs> I think that girl's name is probably Kenny Day. I was looking fly though. No? Wow. Why are you laughing? Uh, I was telling Jordan, I said, that's what you look like, Jordan. Hey, look I at don't look like that. You look like me, that's you. Yes. Standing in front of the house girl. Uh, I said, I was girl, flower girl. Even I was no, wearing wristwatch. Let me tell you something. I don't know if you guys said <laughs> Let me tell you something. Mm -hmm. You look better than this picture. Uh, thank you. I'm, I'm a grown woman now. You look now. better than this picture. I'm a yalla. I'm <laughs> <laughs> I'm a big woman. Guys, guys, I pick up this Indomie. I didn't even know this was the one that was inside. I don't know why they are selling some of this Indomie $9.99. But this one was $7.99. Even the $7.99 I'm paying for this Indomie. It's, 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 it's burning my body. Let me remove this gallery. And this thing. 
Let me put this there. So I brought Indomie. I'm gonna, yeah? Keep one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. I feel like they gave me fifty in this thing. This is eleven. See, it's called only fifty-five naira. How you cannot see? Only fifty-five naira. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten. Two, four, six, eight, nine, ten. Two, Ah, how many are you doing? It's supposed to be forty, no? Are they doing um? Let me count There's supposed again. to be two Indomies there. There need to be. Yeah, it's supposed to be 40. Yeah, there's supposed to be two Indomies there. Are they taking out of it? Yeah, it says 40. You see, it's uh -huh. 40. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. The fact that this one is even 8, 7. Ah, uh, let me count the button. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, no, 7, 8, 9, 10. Wait, wait. 10. 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. 24 was here, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39. It but can't be. No. Can't 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. So that's 20. That's 20. 2, 4, 6, 8, it's 10, 10 30 2 4 6 8 so they took two out of it these people are doing hey and it's 55 anyways oh. can you guys see they have come out still in the <laughs> in the shop it's not to 40 in the park yeah why are they doing that they, uh, mommy paid, uh, a, uh, mommy mommy paid a big price for that oh we're just going to <laughs> hey guys, Hello. can't even remember the last time I vlogged. I think Maybe it was when you finished doing your when you were doing your hair. No, it was when I did the Indomie. Yeah, yeah. I got. <laughs> I've been a very yeah. That was yesterday. I've been mm -hmm. a very very well. There's nothing that's really happened. You've been a very 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 sad day today. Mm -hmm. Oh gosh, my heart. I'm not. You don't I've, need to tell. Because it's going to make you sad. You have been sad. You want to tell? Yeah. Okay, tell us. So, my mom is sad. Mm -hmm. Because in Nigeria, yeah. there was a war yesterday. Yeah. So. Okay, let me let me let me make the vlog just flow. After okay. the old Indomie, because <laughs> I'm sure that was the last one. I was really upset. After the old Indomie thing, your heart is started. Yeah, no, forget it, Jordan. I'm going to go to bed. Don't say anything because okay. I don't. I just want to pop a talk. Um, I was a pop upset about the Indomie thing. We cooked Indomie. We ate. I slept. I'm not really a fun, fun, fun person like that. So I wasn't even sure what was happening. But I woke up the in the morning like like let's say like for something you know i was like okay let me just check what's going on no i was eh hey see my phone is buzzing now okay okay um sorry 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 i'm not really into this social media thing like so jj and jj i want to go and check snapchat tool that me i don't even like to check in the first place then i realized that there's been all these um just and live there i don't want anybody in that place there have been all this shooting and everything fair enough we've been hearing about the protests and I, the way i like it was it was very peaceful because for me i felt like people needed it's just normal 
protesting we do it here nhs staff do it school university they do it they go and protest they say what they want to say the government listen the, you know things like that that was what i expected from the old thing not until i started seeing this ridiculous thing so i now left snapchat though, and i went to whatsapp watching other people's status god the first thing i saw it was people should not be putting that kind of thing because it just gives people it just the trauma i mean is it, is it trauma? I, bet, I, don't, I don't even know the english of it i've just been so honestly i'm not really i'm not really into all of these things you know i had to call all my family not call like kind of message them first i had to take it in for a while i'm like is this really happening like is this really like i see all of this thing in movies okay this is that is happening that is happening for real for real and it's so scary now i think because today is the next day i don't know when you guys have been watching this vlog so today is the 21 yeah. and they've asked everyone in nigeria now to stay inside like this 24 hours lockdown like literally lockdown and i'm watching now that people in london are protesting because Sorry. people in london are protesting and you know there's a lot of literally every angle every corner that you enter that you say so let me enter i try not to go on youtube because i don't know what's happening on that youtube i'm just watching something that would you know make me really happy because it's just so difficult you can't you can't just turn a blind eye on what is happening and i wasn't expecting it to go like this i mean i understand what these people want and it was just a very peaceful thing but for the government to not be attacking people that is just really really wrong you don't do that this in this situation i feel like the government are biting the hands that feed them because these are the people that put you guys in the situation i mean not situation these are the people that put you guys in the position that you are now and you are killing them how does that even make sense make it make sense to me like i'm not i'm speaking to my dad now my dad is telling me they can't go out they want to buy food they can't go to the shop or i don't know or they can't go to, he can't go to the bank i know that the other thing is just ridiculous they're all stuck in the house like you can't go anywhere like why everybody went there to go and ask for them to end sars they want a good government but no the government now say no you people are not going to we're not going to listen to you guys we're good no you don't do that what example are you leaving for your own kids because i'm sure buhari has children no i'm sure she's got girls and this is going to be in the history for life and people are forgetting that this month is black history month a lot of this month is a big i don't know if this happens in other country but in the uk is black history month we've been i've been going to the kids school i went what did i go and do in general um, school indian, indian come and school. tell them i've been uh, i've been in school mm -hmm. or mommy's song and nigeria song i've been going there to go and talk to all those jadins so yeah. i've been teaching them about nigeria i've been promoting nigeria before all of this didn't happen when did i even go baby like two weeks monday yeah, yeah. i went there to go and sing i taught um, them <laughs> yeah, that i just think it's abe igi orombo abe igi orombo come on iwe la re she re wa come on inu wadu yes awaraya yes abe igi imagine i've gone there to teach all these children even those kids when i go and pick jaden up now they're like oh we're still singing the song <laughs> jaden has turned to popular jingle like it's it's just really really sad to see that this thing is happening in my home country and i'm not even the kind of person that like to i try to stay away from bad news because it does actually affect me like mentally like i can't process i don't know how people process things but me i it, it goes into my deep score so seeing all those things on social media i think even my dad was saying like they, they has, they've gone to the oba of lagos they've gone to go and steal they've not turned this whole thing to world 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 two like come on we don't need that we don't need that because people were gonna die people's uncle people's auntie people's brother people's father people's they went to protest in london today and you can see how the police were there to safeguard everything that was what we wanted the, oh my god God. i've said i wasn't gonna 
go into this and just talk about this because i wanted this you know <sighs> It's stressing me out. It's just stressing me out. It's literally, literally stressing me out. <sighs> Anyways, that's what's been going on No, That's what's been going on No, I've just, I'm just, I know. I don't know where next I'm, I'm going to try and, you know, keep, and we also in the UK now, they said, I don't even know, if they, you see, in the UK, there's, um, Kilong Pekini, um, lockdown, there's lockdown happening, there's some people that went to come protest in, um, in, um, um, UK, what's that place, UK border house, I mean, UK passport house, can you see, the, all of them were like sardines, they, they were just pack each other, they, <laughs> sardines, they were just but they were all wearing masks but they were all you know they were all they didn't do social distancing but that's the country that has rules and regulation but nigeria can never be like that i was i was seeing all these pictures of people that were protesting it was so peaceful they did the sunday service there they did the mocks there. we want that unity we want that peace why can they not give us that and we are the one, well, not me. People in Nigeria are the one feeding all those government because they're forgetting that it's, um, it's their money they are using because me, I don't pay tax in Nigeria, so I cannot talk. If it's I cannot be going to be telling them in Nigeria and say, you people should do this because they'll say, how many tax did you pay? But people who are paying taxes there. People's businesses, are, they're, they're, being, they're being looted. It's not fair. And these are the kids that we are leaving this generation for because by the time they are my age, we don't want them to be in the situation whereby the country is rotting good stuff and be proud of where they are because they are not from this country. They only, I only give back to them here. They are Nigerian. They don't want to go back to Nigeria and be, and be chased by SARS and being chased by the police. No! Then they will be, they will turn to this, they will just become this, they'll just forget their culture, forget everything. And this was what I was trying to do in, 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 in Jaden school, just to teach them about the culture so that they would know that, okay, because, not me because you guys are born here means you guys belong here. You guys don't belong here. You were just born here. You, all of you belong to where? Where are you from, Jordan? Nigeria. You are Nigerian. You that was born here from Nigeria. Yeah, you are only born here, but you're from Nigeria. Your roots, your granddad, your grandma, your grand everybody, even me, are from Nigeria. But you don't want the old Nigeria to just be wiped out like that. No, it's not gonna happen. Not while we are hot here. So they should please. They should, I'm sure by the time this video is going up, because this vlog, this one is not gonna go up till probably next week because most of my vlog i pre-recorded the vlog that's going up on sunday is already recorded last week mm. so this one's probably going to be going up the week after mm. so please guys i know i don't have a huge following but let's even with the small one i mean if all of us small 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 like that we can let's just make a nigeria a better place mm. i'm sure if people are there in nigeria now they'll be wishing ah, like, at least let me still be in even if it's a uh, if we even if it's in um, canada or this, let them even leave the country they, they don't want to be in that um, don't let me be speaking what do you think like jerry tired Honestly, I'm just trying to wipe away the memory that I've had today. I don't know what make me enter inside um, um, Snapchat at 4 p.m. that I woke up. I, I was upset with the Indomie. I was upset. I was. I even went back to the shop. Yeah, <laughs> I, I went back to the shop. I went back. I had went. I went back to that shop because for me, one thing I don't like. Like I respect people's religion, people's believes people there but don't yeah. don't cheat me i don't like cheating if i pay the full price for something and he said 40, it should be 40 there. that is that it should be inside so i went back there i told them i showed them the camera i showed them like are oh, you recorded it i was like yeah <laughs> so it was like okay maybe it was then maybe i uh, then i realized that maybe it was maybe when they imported it maybe they made mistake from the i don't know maybe it was from wherever they were importing it from and that indomie was 7.99 but some people are still selling it um the people are still selling it for 9.99 anyway that's the way for another day <laughs> that's another story for another one but let's just please please please, please. let's just peace and unity for every one of us look at this generation his own gender he will teach his own children about nigeria let us not wipe off nigeria yes. out of this surface we need nigeria is fun nigeria is beautiful it is. anyway 
If you live by your long mommy law or day Jordan, say good night to them and go to bed because she didn't right. sleep in by the way if you guys don't know. Bye Jordan. Right. I'll come and um do the room the window later. Anyway guys, me too. I'm gonna I cannot believe you guys. I don't know if I'm, I just need to calm down. Like my body is in my I don't know, it's doing me so much so much. So if I'm happy tomorrow I'll continue the vlog and um hopefully by the end of this week we're gonna be hearing good news. I hope everyone is keeping safe in your house. Um I would also want to say like people that have got like this you guys should, you know, don't think about this a lot. Try and you know, even though this thing is physically we can see that everything is bad at least just for our mental health mental health yes let's let's do what would not make us think about everything around us just surround yourself with positive things we know we know that things are really really bad but just be prayerful if you don't if you don't feel like praying watch something that would just you know put a joy and happiness in your mind don't listen to all those bad news because we already know that there's bad news so you don't need to be listening to it again to spoil our mind where i'm talking because that's how i feel sometimes when i listen to too much bad news i'm like i will just stop just do something else and that's what i'm gonna say anyway guys i love you guys so much honestly you guys don't understand the love i have for everyone in nigeria whether you're my family whether you're not my family i love you guys so much anyway um I'm, i think i'm feeling much better now thank you guys so much ah which one is thank you guys so much i'll see you guys later bye guys hello people i'll start following this camera Every time I'll be flogging this camera, how is everyone doing? Um, I just want to end this vlog here. It's not much of a vlog if I can remember exactly what I have recorded. I personally feel like this week has just been super, super sad. But, I mean, we all know what's going on in the all wide world right now. Um, I haven't really done much this week honestly if i'm saying if i had to say that i'm not sad i have been sad even when i was speaking the other day i can't remember i was just crying like a like a baby like i'm always crying <laughs> but i feel much better today is friday actually and um I don't think I'm gonna be vlogging again for the rest of the week so I thought that would be best for me to just come and end this video most of the video you guys are watching or you guys have been watching previous week were like pre-recorded so probably not vlog again till God knows when maybe I don't know even there's a lot of changes by the time you guys watch this you would have noticed a change and well in my from here to here there's a lot of changes oh, anyway anyway guys we are gonna end this here the boys are actually gonna be on after from today so you can see that my hands are full <sighs> don't even know what to do with them i've still got work we're gonna walk you know and i will sort it out as we usually sort it out <laughs> but um I'm gonna go now and I hope you guys enjoy this vlog we still need each other we need our friends we need our family and we all need each other we need to help each other mentally I thought I was gonna be ups I mean gonna make this video very upsetting but listening to the president's speech yesterday oh my god if I was very close to that man I would slap him and tell him to say the right things out because you can't you heard what he was just saying he was just talking like he doesn't care well he doesn't even care in the first place 12 seconds or 12 minutes was just it was just too annoying it was just oh my gosh people were d anyway so that's all that is happening you know um, I've, I actually went out today to go and do some you know shopping therapist what they call these things i went to just basically go to the shops to look i i just go and look these days i don't buy but i got myself some coffee and you know just to walk around you know because to be honest my family are not doing great great in nigeria but i understand is everyone that's got family in nigeria um that is going through everything so but um you know we're hoping we're seeing what the other weeks will be maybe by the time you guys are watching these things would have been well way 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 better but right now this is how i'm feeling um just helpless because there's really really nothing we can do right here because 
it's just difficult but me and the kids are doing okay everyone around me are doing okay and yeah that's everything i've got to say here i don't know if i get way better i can start vlogging again i don't know but this is where i'm signing out for this week which i think you guys will see this vlog next week because today's already on friday then you know you know you guys will see this the week of maybe end of the month that's what you guys will see this end of the month or the first week of next month bye guys thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you in the next one peace out